Please stay tuned following this presentation for previews of other Barney Home videos. about dinosaurs. Did you, Barney? Oh, yeah, I guess you would. But did you know we've got to take all these books back to the school library today? Come on, we'd better get moving. Hi, Curtis. Curtis. Hi, Curtis. You know, Barney, I think the library may be my favorite place in the whole school. But when you're in the library, you should try to be quiet, okay? You know, if you need help, it's much easier just to ring the bell. It's Booker T. Bookworm. Hiya, guys. Oh, hi there, Booker T. Uh, sorry about making a mess in your library. Oh, that's okay. Accidents happen. Here are the books I borrowed. Oh, great. Did you like them? They were great, Booker T. I read about dinosaurs and rockets and how to build a real birdhouse. Whoa! And just look around the library. There are still lots of other books for you to read, each with its own special surprise. That's right. Books make learning fun. <laughs> books are fun. Books are great. Let's sit down with a book today. Books are fun. Books are great. Is it book time yet? Oh, I just can't wait to read a book. <laughs> Do you know why I love to read a book? Why I get so happy every time I take a look? Because books can take you anywhere that you want to go. Books help my imagination grow. <laughs> to snuggle up and read with somebody like you. All my favorite stories and many more to learn. Good things come with every page I turn. <laughs> books are fun. Books are great. Let's sit down with a book today. Books are fun. Books are great. Is it book time yet? Oh, I just can't wait to read a book. Oh, books can teach you things, or show you pictures, or tell you a story just for fun. That's why I never get tired of reading books. <laughs> I only get tired of putting them back on the shelf. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> wow, after reading so many books, Booker T probably knows just about everything. I wish I could be more like him. Oh, you do, do you? Uh, oh, uh, Booker T... <laughs> yes, Barney. With so many books to take care of, maybe you need a helper. Oh, good idea. <laughs> I could use a helper. 
I'd like to be your helper. Oh, yes, uh, Curtis. You'd make a wonderful helper. Great! Oh, oh boy! <laughs> and I've got a job for you already. Ooh. Right there on Ashley's library card, there's a note with the name of a book she wants to borrow. I'll find it. I'll find it just like you would, Booker T. <laughs> just like me? <laughs> this I've got to see. <laughs> Oh, Miss Etta, I should wish I could fly. Well, sugar, it would help if you had wings. <laughs> oh, 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 hi there, everybody. Oh, oh, I've got something for you, Ashley. It's the library book I wanted. Booker T found it. Oh, actually, Curtis found it. He's the new library helper. Oh, goodness. Curtis already spent so much time in that library. Why, that child may turn into a bookworm. <laughs> <laughs> you know, that looks like a very good book, Ashley. It is. See? Oh, I do love butterflies. Oh, so many different colors, and all of them just beautiful. <laughs> when I look at them, I can almost imagine that these butterflies are real. Oh, you must have a lot of imagination, because they look real to me, too. See? Lovely. Five little butterflies resting at the door. One flew away, and then there were four. Butterfly, butterfly, happy all day. Butterfly, butterfly, fly, fly away. Four little butterflies sitting in a tree. One flew away, and then there were three. Butterfly, butterfly, happy all day. Butterfly, butterfly, fly, fly away. And then there were three. Three little butterflies looking at you. One flew away, and then there were two. Butterfly, butterfly, happy all day. Butterfly, butterfly, butterfly fly, 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 fly away. Two little butterflies. Two little butterflies sitting in the sun. One flew away, and then there was one. Butterfly, butterfly, happy all day. Butterfly, butterfly, fly, fly, fly away. <laughs> oh, oh. One little butterfly sitting all alone. One flew away, and then there were none. Butterfly, butterfly, happy all day. Butterfly, butterfly, fly, fly away. Oh, bye, bye, butterflies. Bye. Beautiful. Flutter by any time. Today. What'd you do? Well, I... Oh, where are all these butterflies coming from? From Ashley's book. Barney! Oh, hello there. <laughs> oh. I got wow, it. that's quite a book. Mm -hmm. I borrowed it from the school library using my library card. See? And it's got your name on it. We've got library cards, too. Oh, so you can all borrow books from the school library. Yeah, <laughs> it's really fun. In fact, I think I'll go check one out right now. Come on, Barney. Oh, okay. <laughs> May I help you? Yes, I'd like to get a book about making things. Here's my library card. Oh, very good. I believe my uh, new assistant can help you. Uh oh. A book about making things? I think you'll like this one. Why don't you check it out? out. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, guys. Does Curtis look sort of different to you? Well, maybe just a little. <laughs> I think it's the new guy. Well, hello there, Scooter. Hi, Miss Etta. What you doing? Well, I'm watching Barney and the children. And they seem to be reading a book. Oh, boy. That means something funny's gonna happen. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah! This is a good book. It shows how to make paper airplanes, and musical instruments, and toys. And spaghetti. Spaghetti? 
Oh, oops. Oh, sorry. I uh, didn't have lunch yet. <laughs> Hmm. Now, where were we? Um, I think it would be fun to make this ocean in a box. Oh, that does look like fun. And this looks like a job for... Uh, the party bag! Oh, right! Oh. oh, I've been looking in my party bag. And I found a lot of things. <laughs> Gizmos and gadgets, odds and ends, and even some old string. So let's ask ourselves a question. What can we make today? With imagination and the horny bag, we'll see what we can make today. <laughs> yeah, we'll see what we can make today. <laughs> oh, I'm so glad we borrowed this book. <laughs> You're being very careful with the scissors. That's good. I'm coloring in some seaweed. Oh, I see. Oh, that's a kind of plant that grows under the water. Now all I have to do is put a big smile on my way. Ooh. You know, I don't think I've ever seen a pink octopus before. It's gonna be different. Oh, okay. <laughs> are those the waves in the ocean, Hannah? Yes, they are. Oh, great. I see a striped fish. So we put the ocean into the box, and it goes along the back. Mm -hmm. Great. Now I'll cut the string. Mm -hmm. You take the string to the fish and the octopus. And now we're putting it all together. Wow, it really does look like an ocean in a box. <laughs> Everything looks so wet and wiggly and wavy. <laughs> Can you imagine what it would be like to live under the sea? I'm not sure, but it would be fun to try. I think it would be neat as it could be, be, be. I could visit all the fish anytime I wish if I lived under the sea. I could ride on the tail of a great big whale. Wow, that would be great. I could count the legs on an octopus. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh. If I lived under the sea, 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 I think it would be neat. It could be, be, be. I could visit all the fish anytime I wish if I lived under the sea. It would be so new to watch a tea, not talking with an itty bitty snail. Or to see the pretty fin on the back of a fish who carries his very own sail. If I lived under the sea, 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 I think it would be neat as it could be. That was oceans of fun. Oh yeah, this is a really great book. Mm, it is. See, you know, I think I'd like to borrow a book too. Well then, let's go. Okay. <laughs> oh, look, yeah, we can make that. That looks fun. Yeah. Oh, hello there. <laughs> How may I help you? I came to check out a book with my library card. Oh, splendid! <laughs> and uh, what did you have in mind? Well, I like books with fun stories and pictures. Well, <laughs> we got lots of those. Oh, Curtis! <laughs> Curtis is starting to look like Booker T. Oh, you know, I think you're right. <laughs> Hannah, for fun stories and pictures, I highly recommend this book. 
Why don't you check it out? <laughs> <laughs> Stories are in store for us. <laughs> Old Mother Hubbard went to the cupboard to get her poor dog a bone. But when she got there, the cupboard was bare, and so her poor dog had none. Oh, I bet he was hungry. <laughs> Jack Sprat could eat no fat, his wife could eat no lean. And so between them both, you see, they licked the platter clean. Lick it clean. Oh, uh, Barney, hmm? is something wrong? Oh, oh no! Well, it, it's just that I didn't have lunch, and all these rhymes make me think about food. <laughs> but you can go on. Please don't let me stop you. Peter, Peter, pumpkin eater. Mm, pumpkin. Mm, 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 Barney! Mm. Oh, I'm sorry. But if the next one is about food, I'm just gonna have to make a snack. <laughs> well, here you go. <laughs> Oh, it's time! Oh boy, let's make some muffins! Do you know the Muffin Man, the Muffin Man, the Muffin Man? Do you know the Muffin Man who lives on Drury Lane? Yes, we know the Muffin Man, the Muffin Man, the Muffin Man. Yes, we know the Muffin Man who lives on Drury Lane. Cross buns, hot cross buns. One a penny, two a penny, hot cross buns. Oh, oh, oh. What's next? Oh, 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 oh. Patty cake, patty cake, baker's man. Bake me a cake as fast as you can. Roll it, pat it, and mark it with the B. And put it in the oven for Barney and me. Oh, 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 oh. I better get the muffins out. <laughs> The Muffin Man, the Muffin Man, the Muffin Man. Do you know the Muffin Man who lives on Drury Lane? Yes, we know the Muffin Man, the Muffin Man, the Muffin Man. Yes, we know the Muffin Man who lives on Drury Lane. Who lives on Drury Lane. Oh, yum. <laughs> Assistance, Barney? Oh, uh, sure. Well, I brought some muffins for you and Booker T. Ah, thank you. Oh, you're welcome. And I'd like to borrow a special book. Certainly. I'm sure I can find what you're looking for. Just like Booker T. Bookworm. Oh. <laughs> oh, by the way, what book were you looking for? Well, it's my favorite book of poetry. I'm sure you've got it. It's about this big, and it's got all sorts of rhymes in it about all sorts of different things. <laughs> And now, the Wiggle Worm. <clears throat> oh, see the little Wiggle Worm who crawls across the dirt, all pink and wet and wiggly. Oh, I've got one down my shirt! Oh, goodness. <clears throat> and here's another poem called Flowers. Roses are red, violets are blue, but mostly they're flat, cause they're under my shoe. <laughs> and finally, <clears throat> little Stinky is a skunk, a handsome little feller, and you can find him anywhere by following your smeller. <laughs> <laughs> I just love it when you laugh with me. <laughs> when I feel happy, I can smile the biggest smile I know. <laughs> then you can see my happy show. <laughs> 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 the sillies, and when you get them, you'll be silly like me. 
I can't stop laughing at you can see. <laughs> I got a giggle, it makes me wiggle, it makes me jiggle too! I can't hold it in, I just gotta giggle! <laughs> 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 Oh, hello there. <laughs> Goodness me, the library is busy today. We're returning the books we borrowed. They were great. They were. Wonderful. <laughs> I'll just have my assistant put these back on the shelves for other girls and boys to borrow. Oh, Curtis. <laughs> Curtis? At your service. Curtis, you look just like Booker T. I do? Mm-hmm. Maybe you should get out of the library and play with us for a while. Yeah, we miss you. I miss you too, but I've got a job to do here at the library, just like Booker T. Bookworm. Just like Booker T, huh? Uh, Booker T, I think I know another book that Curtis might like. Would you mind getting it for me? It's called Dead Peace Oh! Oh, I see. <laughs> Good idea. I'll be back in a flash. <laughs> Oh, I don't know. Mm -hmm. I say, here it is, Curtis. Check it out. Certainly. What is it? It's called Be Yourself. It's all about being the best person you can be just by being yourself. Oh, do you think I was trying too hard to be just like Booker T? Well, maybe, yes. <laughs> yeah, we like you the way you were, Curtis. Well, you don't need to change to be somebody special. And you don't have to be a bookworm to learn from books. <laughs> Booker T's right. We all learn things from books today. Yeah, I think I did too. Oh. You are special. You're the only one. You're the only one like you. There isn't another in the whole wide world who can do the things you do. Cause you are special, special. Everyone is special. You're important, so you really are You're the only one like you The world is better just because you're here You should know that we love you Oh, you are special, special Everyone is special Everyone in his or her own way That's right, so oh, you are special, special Everyone is special The old Curtis back. Oh boy. <laughs> well, I guess I'd better go put some books back on the shelf. Can I still be your helper, Booker T? Even if I'm not just like you? Of course. <laughs> You're the very best helper I've ever had. Oh. <laughs> and you know what? I think I've got the very best friends, too. Oh, funny. That's just what I was going to say. <laughs> I love you, you love me, we're a happy family, with a great big hug and a kiss from me to you, won't you say you love me too?
Hey, Curtis, now do you want to go play with us? Sure, let's go. Okay, let's go. Thanks again, Barney. Bye, see you later. It's time for Barney's Hess. <laughs> Hello again to all my friends. I'm glad you came to play. Our fun and learning never end. Here's what we did today. We borrowed books from the school library. With some help from our good friend Booker T. Bookworm. Ashley checked out a book that taught her about butterflies. Robert likes books that show him how to make things like an ocean in a box. And Hannah's book of rhymes was just for fun, even if it did make me hungry. <laughs> in the library, you'll find books that you love too. And remember, I love you. <laughs> one like this. Yeah, me too. What? Whoa! <laughs> Barney! Hi, Barney. Steven. Hi, Keisha. Sorry about throwing you, Barney. I was looking at Keisha's new bike. Oh, that is a nice one. I wish I had a new bike. Oh, it's such a pretty purple color. Oh, look at this nice horn. <laughs> uh, uh, Keisha? Uh, huh? Oh, sorry, Barney. <laughs> I was just looking over there. <laughs> oh, well, it looks like Jeff's poster won a ribbon. <laughs> yeah, I sure wish my poster had won a ribbon. <laughs> That is nice. I'll bet that gives you a happy feeling, right? Uh, uh, Jeff? Oh, uh, I guess so. But I really wish I could be a school safety helper, like Kristen. Oh! <laughs> Hi, Kristen! Hi, Barney. Hi, Jeff. <laughs> All Hi. done helping the other kids cross the street? Uh-huh. So now I can play for a while. Oh, good. <laughs> Whoa, look at that! I wish I could throw footballs the way Steven does. Oh, so, uh, let me get this straight. Um, Steven wishes he had a new bike like Keisha. Yeah. And Keisha wishes she could win a ribbon like Jeff did. I sure do. And Jeff wishes he could be a safety helper like Kristen. Uh-huh. And Kristen wishes she could throw a football like Steven, right? 
Right. <laughs> well, I wish we could turn these sad faces into happy faces. And I think I know how. <laughs> if all the raindrops were lemon drops and gumdrops, oh, what a rain that would be. Standing outside with my mouth open wide. Ah, 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 ah. If all the raindrops were lemon drops and gumdrops, oh, what a rain that would be. <laughs> I'm starting to see those smiles already. <laughs> What a snow that would be! And the weatherman would be confused. <laughs> if all the raindrops were lemon drops and gumdrops, oh, what a rain that would be! Boom. Standing outside with my mouth open wide! Ah, 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 If all the raindrops were lemon drops and gumdrops, oh, what a rain that would be! <laughs> Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, four bright, smiling faces. That's what I wanted to see. <laughs> Although it sounds like each of you wanted something you didn't have. Do not. Do two. Do not. Do two. Do not. Do not. Do not. Do not. What's the matter, BJ? Oh, a sissy gets to take it easy all day. Oh, do not. Do two. Do not. Oh, she doesn't have what? any jobs or chores. Well, I wish I could do what she does. Oh. Well, BJ gets to do whatever he wants without any help. I wish I could do what he does. Well, when you want something that someone else has, it can make you feel sad or even a little bit mad. Or a lot mad, huh? Uh, BJ. Hey. Oh, well, I've got an idea. You two each want what the other one has. So why don't you just trade places? Huh? <laughs> well, just for today, Baby Bop can pretend to be BJ. Oh, yeah. And BJ can pretend to be Baby Bop. That'd be easy. Oh, is that okay with both of you? Yeah. Okay, <laughs> then. This is gonna be great. Great? My stars. This is gonna be silly. <laughs> BJ is my name. I'd love to play a game of baseball or maybe basketball. I'm usually in a hurry. Stop to worry, but what'll happen if I trip or fall? <laughs> I like to play my drum. Boom, boom, boom. I like to jump and run. I like to climb a tree. Whoa, whoa. Though I might skin my knee. Ow. And when I dig in the dirt. Ow. Sometimes I wipe it on my shirt. Oh, yeah, yeah. With the hat that's neat. <laughs> BJ really is pretending to be Baby Bob. <laughs> I like my blankie. It's very, very yellow. I like it even better than a bowl of jello. When she holds it close, it feels just right. I like my yellow blankie in the day and night. She likes her yellow blankie in the day and night. <laughs> 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 Well done! Wait a minute, this is all mixed up! All mixed up! Baby Bop is playing baseball! Mm -hmm. Oh, and BJ has a sweet little old yellow blankie. Uh, yeah, let me get this straight. <laughs> Baby Bop is pretending to be BJ. And BJ is pretending to be Baby Bop, right? Yes, yeah, Scooter! <laughs> 
I got it! I got it! <laughs> <laughs> It sure is funny to see BJ acting like Baby Bob. Yes, he said he was going to make paper dolls. Oh, what? What's Baby Bob doing? She said she was going to dig in the dirt for worms. Oh. <laughs> well, that's what they wanted. That's how they say hello and goodbye in Greece. And that's where I just come from. Oh, what were you doing in Greece, Stella? Well, today is the day for my bazooki lesson. <laughs> <laughs> and while I was there, I also got some more stories. What kind of stories? <laughs> well, stories that were written in Greece a long, long time ago by a man named Aesop. And I thought of one of those stories when I heard someone say, well, that's what they wanted. Hey, I said that. <laughs> yes, I know you did. <laughs> okay, and Jeff, would you help me tell the story? Oh, sure. <laughs> okay. Well, once upon a time, there was a very happy dog. And do you know why he was happy? Because he had a great big yummy bone to chew on. Well, the dog decided to have a little picnic by the edge of a pond. But just as he was getting ready to enjoy his bone, he looked into the water. And what do you think he saw? A fish? A frog? A turtle? He saw his very own reflection. But he thought it was another dog with another bone. Ooh, thought the dog. I want that bone too. And I'll make the other dog give it to me. First, he tried whimpering and whining and looking so sad. But the other dog didn't give him the bone. Next, he tried snarling and growling and looking mean. But the other dog still didn't give him the bone. Well then, thought the dog, I'll just have to grab that bone. But as soon as he opened his mouth, his bone dropped into the water. And it sank to the bottom of the lake. So, instead of having two bones, the greedy dog had none. <laughs> and the moral of the story is... Don't let the things you want make you forget the good things you already had. <laughs> the end! <laughs> now that was a doggone good story. Thank you, Stella. <laughs> you are very welcome. <laughs> <laughs> but I really must be going. So, as they say in Greece, yes. Yes. Toodles. See you soon. <laughs> oh, wait, wait. Was that Stella? Uh, I wanted to hear a story. <laughs> you did? Oh, I thought you wanted to be like me. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's what I want. <laughs> Good, because I was going to play a game of make-believe today. Oh, you were? Uh-huh. A nice make-believe jungle game Ow. with lions Ow. and tigers Ow. and snakes. Ow. <laughs> but now, I guess you'll have to be the brave jungle explorer. Uh, I will. Well, it's what you wanted. Oh, yeah, it's what I wanted. Oh, we're going on a jungle adventure to see what we can see. Oh, look! There's a lion and a tiger and a great big monkey swinging on the branch of a tree. It looks like a chimpanzee. Oh, oh here oh. in the jungle you can hear the lions roar.
a great big elephant taking a bath, getting clean as he can be. <laughs> The jungle is the place to go. The jungle is the place to go. Baby Bob. Oh, gee, she was here a minute ago. Uh, Barney, hmm? are, are the animals gone yet? <laughs> oh, oh, sissy, I just wanted to scare you a little. You did? Well, I thought you wanted to be like me. Oh, yeah, that's what I want. Oh, good. <laughs> because I was going to play a game of make-believe today, too. You were. Uh-huh. But now you'll have to do it. And here's what I was gonna be. Come here. Oh, no. You can't make me do that. <laughs> <laughs> well, you did say it's what you wanted. Ay, ay, ay. Okay. <laughs> Oh, my! This is so exciting! Yeah, yeah, this should be good! <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, presenting the story of the Sleeping Princess. <laughs> Nobody says a word! Oh, man. <laughs> 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 There was a pretty princess, a princess, Me, a, princess. a princess. There was a pretty princess oh. long ago. A spell was cast upon her, upon her, upon her. A spell was cast upon her long ago. Okay, that was fun. Oh, you're not through yet, BJ. <laughs> the castle was enchanted, enchanted, enchanted. The castle was enchanted long ago. A hundred years she slept there, she slept there, she slept there. A hundred years she slept there, long ago. <laughs> <laughs> the thorns grew thick around it, around it, around it. The thorns grew thick around it, long ago. <laughs> Ooh. A handsome prince came riding, came riding, came riding. A handsome prince came riding, long ago. You gotta kiss her to wake her up. Ah, no kissing, no way. He woke the pretty princess, the princess, the princess. He woke the pretty princess, long ago. Ah, for me, thanks. You can steal my heart. <laughs> They had a royal wedding, a wedding, a wedding. They had a royal wedding long ago. They lived their lives together, together, together. They lived their lives together long ago. There's your baby. Congratulations. Okay, that's it. The party's over. Fun. But now it's my turn. Now I can do some other things that Baby Bop does. Like play with toys, or play a game, or, or take a nap. Yeah, take a nap. Hey, I don't want to take a nap. Well, Baby Bop always takes a nap right about now. Uh-huh, if you don't have your nap, you'll get cranky. Aw, man. Oh, see? Cranky baby. <laughs> <laughs> but I can't take a nap. I'm not even sleepy. Hmm. Well, I think it might be a good idea if Baby Bob sang you a lullaby. <laughs> Come on, BJ. Over here. Sit down. <laughs> now just relax and listen to the song. It's very pretty. Hush <laughs> up, Don't you cry. Go to sleep, little baby. And when you wake, you 
sure have a cake. And all the pretty little ponies. Paint and bang, soil and grain. All the pretty little ponies. So hush a bye, don't you cry. Go to sleep, little baby. I'm not getting sleepy yet. Try rubbing the nice soft blanket higher. Hush a bye, don't you cry. Go to sleep, little baby. And when you wake, you shall have a cake. And all the pretty little ponies. Uh, uh, there you go, sissy. Paint and bang, sorrow and grain. All the pretty little ponies. So hush a bye, don't you cry. Go to sleep, little baby. Did you have a nice nap, Sissy? Uh-huh. And now, well, hey! I got my blankie back! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> While you were sleeping, BJ decided that he'd really like to be BJ again. I sure would. And I think you'd probably like to be Baby Bob again, right? Uh-huh. <laughs> When I wanted to be Baby Bob, mm -hmm. I was just feeling kind of mad inside. Mm. That's okay, BJ. I was feeling kind of mad today, too. You were? How come? Well, I wanted a new bike like Keisha's. Yeah, and I was feeling sad today because my poster didn't win a ribbon like Jeff's did. Really? I was wishing I could be a school safety helper, like Kristen. No kidding. And I was feeling bad because I can't throw a football the way Steven does. Well, it's like I said, sometimes everybody wants things they don't have. And if that makes you a little bit mad or a little bit sad, you're just like everyone else. Huh. Yeah. Uh, but, but Barney, mm -hmm. wait a minute. Mm -hmm. See, I still want to be big like BJ. Okay. Uh, I want to do things without help. Oh, and you're going to. I am? Oh, sure. You're growing every day. And you'll be a big girl before you know it. Oh, oh. Barney, win, 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 win. Oh, I can't do it. There's nothing to it. I can't do it by myself. Had to ask for help when I was small. But now I'm bigger. I can do it all. I'll be feeling proud, as you can tell, when I can do it by myself. Tie your shoes. I can do it. I can do it. By yourself. I can do it. I can do it. Comb your hair. I can do it. I can do it. By yourself. I can do it. I can do it. are small, but when you're bigger, you can do it all. I'll be feeling proud, as you can tell, when I can do it by myself. Tie your shoes. I can do it. I can do it. By yourself. I can do it. I can do it. Cut your hair. Just watch! Whee! <laughs> I can jump on my bed! But Scooter, you're not supposed to jump on your bed. Why not? <laughs> That's why not. Uh -oh. <laughs> 
Good idea. Well, I think it would be a good idea if Sissy and I were getting home. Yeah, because I think BJ needs his nap. Sissy. See you later, guys. I'm glad BJ and Baby Bop have gone back to being themselves. Oh, me yeah. too. After all, being yourself is very important. Because that's just the way I love you. <laughs> I love you. You love me. We're a happy family. With a great big hug and a kiss from me to you. Won't you say you love me too? <laughs> I love you, you love me We're best friends like friends should be With a great big hug and a kiss from me to you Won't you say you Want to go practice throwing footballs? Yeah, that'd be fun. <laughs> Only this time. I won't throw Barney. Okay, Barney? <laughs> hey, everybody, it's time for Barney Says. <laughs> Hello again to all my friends. I'm glad you came to play. Our fun and learning never end. Here's what we did today. It seemed like everyone wanted something they didn't have. Sometimes that can make you feel a little bit sad or a little bit mad. Remember the dog in Stella's story? He wanted another bone so much that he forgot he already had one. And Baby Bop and BJ found out that they're happiest just being themselves. That's why I love them. And remember, I love you.
this a nice house for Barney. He even has a window to look out of. But we forgot to build a doorway. Oh, 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 it sure is good to see you. Uh, sorry about the mess. No, oh, that's right, okay. okay. <laughs> my, my, my. Messy, messy, messy. Too many toys. <gasps> Hi, Baby Bob. Hi, there. Hi everybody. <laughs> Except I'm not Baby Bob today. Oh, who are you? I'm Safety Officer Baby Bob. BJ taught me lots of safety rules. And when I see something that's not safe, I blow my whistle. <gasps> oh, are you blowing your whistle because we haven't picked up our toys yet? That's right. <laughs> Someone could fall down and get hurt stepping on a toy. Uh -huh. We were just about to clean everything up, Baby Bob. <laughs> Excuse me. Safety Officer Baby Bob. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Would you like to help us? Sure! <laughs> now it's time to put away everything that we took out. When the room is nice and clean, it makes us feel so proud. We always clean up, clean up, to show we really care. We always clean up, clean up, cause we like to do our share. Here, I'll hold it for you. Job. Oh, this looks much better. And much safer. Yeah. <laughs> hey, 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 everybody, come see what I found out on the porch. Oh, 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 I don't know. Oh, oh, yeah. <laughs> what is it, Scooter? Well, uh, uh, it's a blue. Uh, it's blue. <laughs> I don't know. It's a bird's egg. Oh, oh, let me see, let me see. Oh, it's a beautiful egg. <laughs> I think it's pretty, too. I've never seen a blue egg before. I wonder where it came from. Well, many birds build their nests in trees. Like these. <laughs> there was a hole. There was a hole. In the middle of the ground. In the middle of the ground. The prettiest hole. The prettiest hole. That you ever did see. That you ever did see. And the green grass grows all around, all around. And the green grass grows all around. And in this hole. And in this hole. There was a tree. There was a tree. The prettiest tree. The prettiest tree. That you ever did see. That you ever did see. Well, the tree in the hole and the hole in the ground. And the green grass grows all around, all around. And the green grass grows all around. And on this tree, and on this tree, there was a branch. There was a branch. The prettiest branch. The prettiest branch. That you ever did see. That you ever did see. Well, the branch on the tree, and the tree in the hole, and the hole in the ground. And, and the green grass grows all around, all around. And the green grass grows all around. And on this branch, and on this branch, there was a nest. There was a nest. The prettiest nest. The prettiest nest. That you ever did see That you ever did see Well, the nest on the branch And the branch on the tree And the tree in the hole And the hole in the ground And the green grass grows all around All around And the green grass grows all around And in this nest And in this nest There was an egg There was oh, an egg The prettiest egg The prettiest egg That you ever did see That you ever did see well, the egg in the nest, and the nest on the branch, and the branch on the tree, and the tree in the hole, and the hole in the ground. And the green grass grows all around, all around, and the green grass grows all around. And in this egg, in this egg, there was a bird. There was a bird. The prettiest bird. The prettiest bird. That you ever did see. That you ever did see. 
go the bird and the egg and the egg in the nest and the nest on the branch and the branch on the tree and the tree in the hole and the hole in the ground and the green grass grows all around all around and the green grass grows all around and the green grass grows all around all around and the green grass grows all around I don't see a nest up in this tree Barney well then we'll need to make a nest for our egg come on Here's your new home, little egg. You'll be safe here. Whoa. Great job, everybody. Now our egg is neatly nestled into a nice nest. That's the first bird's nest I've seen in a doll's cradle. <laughs> <laughs> Did I hear someone say, bird's nest? <laughs> Scooter found this bird's egg on the porch. We couldn't find the nest it fell out of, so we made this one. Oh. Poor little lost egg. Well, I'd be delighted to watch over it for you, children. Oh, that's great, Miss Etta. I'm sure the egg will be safe with you. Oh. I'll get it. Wonder who that could be. <laughs> Hello, who's there? It's me, Tim. Come on down. I've got something to show you. Okay, be right there. <laughs> hey, it's Kim. She has something to show us. Let's go. <laughs> Thanks for reminding us, Baby Bop. Never ride down the stairs. And always hold the railing to keep from falling and hurting ourselves. Very good. <laughs> uh, what are you writing, Safety Officer Baby Bop? Oh, well, I really don't know, but it's fun to pretend. <laughs> oh, you're right, it is. Okay, all done. Let's go, Barney. Okay. Oh, hold my hand, please. Everybody, check out my new helmet. Wow. Oh, that's a very nice color. Yeah, it's cool. Thanks. It protects my head if I accidentally fall off my bike. Oh, it's important to be safe when you're riding your bike or doing anything, like playing at the playground or crossing the street. BJ says there are lots of things we can do to be safe near the street. That's right, Baby Bob. First, we should remember to cross at the corner. And always look both ways, mm -hmm. then look both ways again, and then cross the street. And hold a grown-up's hand! That's right! Being safe while you're near the street is very important! Oh, when I walk, oh, when I walk, across the street, across the street, oh, when, when I walk, walk across, across the street. The street. Across the street. Across the street. Oh, oh, when, when I walk across the street. Oh. I always stop, look, and listen. Good. When, when I, I walk, walk across, across the street. The street. <laughs> okay, Barney, now it's my turn. Oh, <laughs> oh, when, I walk. oh when I walk across the street. Across the street. Oh, oh, when I walk. Anyone think of another way to be safe near the street? We can let crossing guards help us cross the street safely every day at school. That's right, Kim. There are lots of people who keep us safe or take care of us if we need help. Would you like to see? Yeah! Okay! <laughs> like Kim said, crossing guards stop cars so you and your friends can cross the street safely. Like that. <laughs> Look, there's a police 
officer. Oh, that's right. Police officers help to keep us safe, too. They protect us. If ever I'm in trouble, I'll ask a police officer for help. Oh, that's good. Wow, look at the fire engine. Ooh. Firefighters are always ready to put out a fire. One day a firefighter came to our school. She told us not to play with fire. That's good advice. I saw an ambulance once on the way to school. Well, if people are hurt, ambulance drivers can take them to the hospital really fast. They have flashing lights and a siren, too. Mm -hmm. Lifeguards are really good swimmers and watch us when we play at pools. They'll swim to us and help if we're in trouble in the water. My mom says to stay where the water is deep. Oh, that's a good idea, Emily. Remember, lifeguards, police officers, firefighters, and crossing guards are all safety people you can count on. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> Some fun in the classroom. Ooh. Like what? Well, we could make some super de duper soup. Great idea, Bonnie. Let's go. Oh, yum. Oh, boy. Oh, do you want to come, Baby Bob? Oh, no, thank you. I think I'll go see how our little egg is doing. Oh, okay. <laughs> we'll see you later. Bye, oh, Bonnie. So long. <laughs> oh, let's see what we can make. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I was standing in the kitchen talking to my friends and we decided to make a special soup. It would be real different cause it would have something from each food group. And we're gonna call it Mish Mash Soup. Ooh. And we don't know how it's gonna taste. No. It's gonna look a little weird and seem a little strange but we won't let it go to waste. Looks like we've got everything we need. So in goes some bread, and then a little milk. Now don't forget some fish. And the fruits and veggies that we put in next. We'll make a very special dish. And we're gonna call it Mish Mash Soup. And we don't know how it's gonna taste. No. It's gonna look a little weird. It seems a little strange, but we won't let it go to waste. Safety officer, Baby Bop. It's not safe to go near a hot stove or hot pots. Ooh, that's right. We should never touch the stove or anything on it. We might burn ourselves. <laughs> but uh, <clears throat> this is just a pretend stove. Oh, oh okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, let's see. <laughs> well. Ooh, yum, yum. Our mishmash soup wasn't too hot. It was just right. Oh, I love to be the soup tester. Before I eat soup, my mom always tests it to be sure it's not too hot. Same goes with bath water. Uh huh? What do you mean, Scooter? Miss Ella's always telling me. <coughs> Scooter McNutty, you be careful. She always tests the water before I take a bath. Oh, Scooter's <laughs> right. Always have a grown-up run your bath water and test it before you get into the tub. And make sure there's a grown-up in the room when you're in the tub. Right. Well, I think I'm going to scoot up to the treehouse and check on the egg. See you later. Oh, okay, so Bye, Scooter. Bye-bye, Scooter. <laughs> Barney, I'm doing a special project with clay. Would you please help me? Oh, I really like making things with clay. Well, actually, you won't be making anything. You'll be helping me in another way. Oh. Oh, well, I can help too. Okay. Oh, good. Let's see what she means. La la la, la la la, la 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 la. Wow, Scooter McNutty, whatever are you doing? Well, I was just uh, rocking the egg and singing a lullaby. Oh, well, you must be careful around that little bitty egg. We don't want it to fall out and break. <gasps> Well, you're right, Miss Ella. Mm. I'll be more careful. <laughs> uh, la, la, la. Oh, really nice. Isn't that lovely? La, 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 la. <laughs> oh, 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 can I look now? <laughs> Not yet, Barney, but it's almost finished. Okay. Just another little spot of yellow. Oh. Yeah. There! <laughs> a 
Okay, Barney. Oh. It's done. You can look now. Oh, oh goody. Oh, we can't <laughs> wait to see. Oh, 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 oh that's super deep. Super Kim. Oh, oh, you did a terrific job. And you remembered an important safety rule. That's right, Barney. I used plastic knives and wooden sticks to cut and shape the clay. Mm -hmm. Oh, it looks just like me. <laughs> Except it's a little smaller. <laughs> I don't think there's enough play in the whole school to make it as big as Barney. <laughs> hey, stop! Come back here! Stop! That sounds like Scooter! Oh, oh, yeah, but no running! Say goodbye! Stop! Stop! Come back here! Scooter! Scooter. What's wrong, Scooter? Just gathering some nuts and a big hungry crow said he'd help, but then he took them all. A uh, crow? Did you know him? No, he was a stranger. A stranger, I see. Hmm. Barney, huh? what's a stranger? Oh, a stranger is someone you don't know, Baby Bob. Oh. Why, Scooter McNutty, how many times have I told you? Be careful and never talk to strangers. Mm, yes, that is right, Scooter. And that's good advice for all of you to remember. <laughs> it's fun to be outside. <laughs> it's great to run and play. Yeah. <laughs> but the people who love you <laughs> want you to be safe. So if a stranger talks to you, Here's what to do, tell a grown-up friend If a stranger talks to you Tell a grown-up friend Cause they know just what to do You know everything's gonna be alright If you see a grown-up friend nearby Here's what to do Stranger is someone you've never met before. Although they may seem nice, sometimes it's hard to know. So if a stranger talks to you, here's what to do. Tell a grown-up friend. If a stranger talks to you, tell a grown-up friend. Cause they know just what to do. You know everything's gonna be alright When you see a grown-up friend nearby Here's what to do, tell a grown-up friend If a stranger talks to you, tell a grown-up friend Tell a grown-up friend Scooter I don't mean to sound like an old grown by reminding you to be careful so often, but I just want you to be safe, sugar. Aw, thanks, Miss Yetta. You're a great friend. Oh. Ooh, it's true. We say be careful to our friends because we care about them. Saying be careful is kind of like saying I love you. <laughs> saying be careful.
Like our little egg is resting safely in its nest. Let me see. Let me see. Watch out! Oh, no, the egg fell out of the nest. Did it break? I don't think so. Oh, let's go see. Oh, follow me. <laughs> see? <laughs> the egg didn't break. It landed safely on Baby Bop's blankie. I know. I put it there just in case. Oh, very good, Baby Bop. <laughs> You're a terrific safety officer. <laughs> and here's an official badge just for you. Wow. <laughs> Danny, would you do the honors? Sure. <laughs> Good, your yep. badge. Oh, that tickles. <laughs> <laughs> Three cheers for safety officer Baby Bob. Hip, hip. Hooray! Hip, hip. Hooray! Hip, hip. Hooray! 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 Thank you, my very own shiny. <laughs> oh, I want to show it to PJ. And then I'm going to tell him about the egg. Bye, Barney. Oh, and then I'll put my blankie under it. Bye, everybody. Oh, and oh, I'm going to my whistle. I never knew being careful could be so much fun, Barney. <laughs> yes, I had a great time. Oh, it's fun to be with people who care about you and love you. <laughs> I love you. You love me. We're a happy family With a great big hug and a kiss from me to you Won't you say you love me too? <laughs> I love you, you love me We're best friends like friends should be With a great Guess I better be going. Ooh. Me too. See you soon, Barney. Okay, bye -bye. so long. Bye-bye. Take care of the oh. egg. Bye. 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 to all my friends. I'm glad you came to play. Our fun and learning never end. Here's what we did today. We had a great time learning about safety today, especially with help from our good friend, Baby Bob. We learned that picking up your toys can be fun. Always wear a helmet when riding your bike and never talk to strangers. And when you're near the street, there are some special safety rules to remember, too. Like holding hands with a grown-up. And always look both ways, and then look both ways again before you cross the street. Safety Officer Baby Bob saved our special egg with her blankie. Way to go, Baby Bob! We also learned that saying, be careful, is another way of saying that you care. So, be careful. And remember, I love you. <laughs>
What a beautiful day. Doesn't it feel great to be outside? Yeah, this is my favorite time of day. You mean when it's time to come out and play? That's <laughs> just what I mean. Okay, what do we want to play first? How about hide and seek? Or tag? What's that, Barney? You want to play ring around the rosy? Well, that's yeah, a good idea. Ring around the rosy. We should use this hoop to help us make a circle. Okay. Yeah. You can sit here in the middle, Barney. It looks like there's a ring around me. <laughs> we were playing ring around the rosy, Barney. <laughs> Here, let us help you get that off. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Ashley. Thank you, Keisha. You're welcome. <laughs> we were using this hoop to help us make a circle for our game. Ooh. Would you like to play ring around the rosy with us? Oh, I certainly would. Thank you very much. <laughs> yeah, ring around the rosy, a pocket full of posies. Ashes, ashes, we all fall down. Head <laughs> back up again, oh. Tiptoe round the rosy, a pocket full of posies. Ashes, ashes, we all fall down. <laughs> oh, oh, very good, oh. Let's try hopping. Hop around the rosy, a pocket full of posies. Ashes, ashes, we all fall down. Oh, oh, we need better run. Oh. Run around the rosy, a pocket full of posies. Ashes, ashes, we all fall down. <laughs> Perfect pancakes, so round and delicious. Yum, yum, yum. Boy, those pancakes look good. Huh, Miss Anna? Oh, my heaven, just look at all those pancakes. I hope you don't eat too many, BJ. They could give you a tummy ache. <laughs> nah, I never get tummy aches, Miss Anna. What you need are some nuts for those pancakes. <laughs> delicious. Smells good. Yeah, it's making me hungry. <laughs> me too. I wish I had a snack. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> Sounds like your tummy wants a snack too, Barney. Oh, yeah. a snack does sound good. Maybe we should have a picnic. Well, okay then. We have lots of healthy snacks. And do you know what else we have? What, Ashley? We have lots of circles. Circles? Yeah. All of these snacks are round, like circles. The cucumbers and the crackers. Even the oranges are cut in circles. Hey, you're right. And they're all yummy circles. Yeah. Well, is everybody ready for a snack? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Here are the plates. There you go. Hey, the so plates are shaped like circles, too. Now we have circle plates to go with our circle snacks. <laughs> Everything looks so good, I can't decide what to choose. Well, how about some of each? <laughs> there are so many foods that you can choose. From chicken and rice to vegetable stews. If you're willing to try, you can't go wrong. A little bit of everything will help you grow strong. <laughs> Say yum, yum, yum. Yum, yum, yum. Yum, yum, yum. Yum, yum, yum. Listen to your tummy. Say, mm, this food is yummy. Say yum, yum, yum. Yum, yum, yum. Yum, yum, yum. Yum, yum, yum. Good food is good for you. Skin and your 
your muscles underneath. Whoa. Say yum yum yum. Yum yum yum. Yum yum yum. Yum yum yum. yum, yum. Listen to your tummy say. Ooh, this food is yummy. Say yum yum yum. Yum yum yum. Yum yum yum. Yum yum yum. yum, yum, yum. Good food. <laughs> Listen, what's that sound? I think it's coming from the treehouse. Oh, it sounds like BJ. We better go see what's wrong. Come on, everybody. It sounds good. Oh. PJ, what's the matter? You okay? Are you okay? Uh, it's my tummy. Hmm? It doesn't feel so good. Do you have a tummy ache? Uh-huh. It's never fun to have a tummy ache. I'm sorry, BJ. Uh, thanks, guys. Oh, let's see. You don't feel like you have a fever. Well, that's good news. Hmm. What can we do to help you feel better? What, Keisha? Well, this looks like a special pillow my little sister has. Mm -hmm. When she has a tummy ache, she holds it like this, and it helps her feel better. Mm. Why don't you try it, BJ? Uh, I'll tell you what it looks like to me. It's a circle, like a pancake. Mm. And I don't want any more pancakes. Mm. Well, how many pancakes did you eat? Well... Was all of this pancakes? Uh-huh. And was this pancakes, too? Uh-huh. And this? Uh-huh. And this? Uh-huh, uh-huh. Oh, that is a lot of pancakes, BJ. <laughs> I guess your tummy is telling you that you ate too many. Yeah, I just wish it had told me sooner. Oh. Uh. <laughs> Every bite of food you eat, a sandwich or a little treat, it all goes there. Can you guess where? Oh, where? It might be big, it might be little. It has a button right in the middle. Everybody's got one. My tummy, my tummy, it's my tummy. Oh, I get it. Above it are my arms and head. Below it are my feet and legs. And it's in between. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, I think so. <laughs> it might be big, it might be little. It has a button right in the middle. Everybody's got one. My, my tummy. tummy, my tummy, it's my tummy. <laughs> now you know where it can be found. So wrap your tummy round and round. <laughs> round and round. Everybody's got one, my tummy, my tummy, it's my tummy! Oh. <laughs> yeah, and mine's really full. <laughs> I guess so. <laughs> BJ, are you feeling any better? Well, I guess I feel a little better. Whoa. But not all better. Oh. There must be something we can do to help you feel better. Huh. You know what my mom does when I'm feeling a little better, but not all better? What, Anna? She does funny things to make me laugh. Huh, and that works? Yeah. Oh, that's right, BJ. Sometimes laughing can make you feel better. I guess it's worth a try. Okay, everybody. Who's ready to laugh? Well, then, put on your silly faces and let's go. When I feel happy, I can smile the biggest smile I know. Then you can see my happy show! <laughs> ha ha ha! He he he! Come on, get silly and laugh with me! Giggle, gaggle, wiggle, waggle, ho ho ho! When you're feeling happy, let it show! <laughs> Look at Hannah! <laughs> I bet the sillies, and when you get them, you'll be silly like me! I can't stop laughing as you can see! <laughs>
<laughs> I got a tickle. It makes me wiggle. Makes me jiggle, too. <laughs> Can't hold it in. I just gotta giggle. <laughs> 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 You were so ticklish. <laughs> Me neither. Oh, thanks, guys. I think I am starting to feel better. Great. Want to play some ball? I think my tummy feels well enough to do that. Oh, that's terrific, BJ. Let's go. <laughs> You did? Yeah, I ate too many nuts. How many nuts did you eat, Scooter? Well, I don't know, but it made me feel pretty nutty. <laughs> oh, my heavens. Yeah. <laughs> Look what we found in the classroom. Oh, cool. Oh, this will be great. Yeah. All right, a soccer ball. And a basketball. Mm. Oh, look, a purple ball. Would you like to play with this one, Barney? <laughs> Why, thank you, Hannah. You're welcome. <laughs> hey, look at this. Oh, that one's as flat as a pancake. <laughs> oh, no, not pancakes. Oh, oh. Don't make me think of pancakes. Oh, oh, whoops. <laughs> Sorry, BJ. Well, uh, all right, uh, uh, just think of the fun things you can do with all these balls. <laughs> uh, you're right, Barney. There are lots of different games we can play. <laughs> well, you can throw them. You can catch them, pass them, bat them, get your dog to fetch them when you have a ball. You have the world's greatest toy of all. You can hit them, you can roll them, kick them, bounce them, you can even bowl them when you have a ball. When you have a ball! You have the world's greatest toy of all. There are big ones, there are small ones. Hard ones, soft ones, bounce against the wall ones when you have a ball. When you have a ball, you have the world's greatest toy of all. Yes, when you have a ball. When you have a ball, you have the world's greatest toy of all. It's the world's greatest toy of all. It's a ball. Good at that, BJ. <laughs> Thanks, Ashley. I'm thinking about being a basketball player when I grow up. Oh, boy. <laughs> Shoot! Oh, oh, yeah. oh, oh, you certainly <laughs> seem to be feeling better now, BJ. I am feeling better, Barney. Oh. I'm feeling a lot better. <laughs> I can see it on your face. <laughs> what? Do I have something on my face? <laughs> no, silly. I can see it on your face that you're feeling better because you look happy. Uh -oh. <laughs> you're right, Isha. Feeling better does make me happy. <laughs> Sometimes I feel happy, and that's just fine with me. I think feeling happy is my favorite way to be. You can tell I'm happy by the smile on my face. Yes, yeah, sometimes I feel happy. You can see it on my face. <laughs> All right. Sometimes I feel angry, because some things make me mad. Whenever someone treats me bad, you can tell I'm angry by the frown on my face. Yes, yeah, sometimes I feel angry. You can see it on my face. Sometimes I feel sad, cause some things make me blue. I pucker up my little lip and cry a tear or two. You can tell I'm sad by the look on my face. Yes, yeah, sometimes I feel sad. You can see it on my face. I can tell what you're feeling by the look on your face Each and every feeling has its time and its place But feeling mad or sad should only last a little while So happiness can fill your heart And give you back your smile Yes, I can tell what you're feeling I 
can see it on your face. When you're angry. Uh, I can see it on your face. Or when you're sad. Uh, I can see it on your face. Or when you're happy. <laughs> I can see it on your face. And I can see something on your face, too, Scooter. Uh, you can see that I'm happy? No, dear. I can see your lunch. Oh, I oh. guess I forgot to use my napkin. Mm. Okay. Good to the What are you guys painting, Hannah? We're painting a picture of the sun, and it's just for you, BJ. Oh, really? That's cool! Oh, what a great idea! On rainy days, BJ can look at your picture and see the sunshine. Oh, I'd really like that! <laughs> oh, what are you going to paint, Stephen? Gee, I don't know yet. Hmm. How about a picture of a house? But a house is too hard to paint. Oh, it can be really easy. By putting different shapes together, you can make lots of things. A square with a triangle on top can be a house. Like this, Barney? Well, that's right, Keisha. I think I could do that. Oh, all you have to do is paint the shapes. <laughs> we like the shapes. We like the shapes. We can paint them all right here. We like the shapes. We like the shapes. We can paint them all right here. This one has four sides and it is called a square. This one has four sides and it is called a square. The squares, four sides are all the same. All the same. The squares, four sides are all the same. All the same. We like the shapes, we like the shapes, we can paint them all right here. We like the shapes, we like the shapes, we can paint them all right here. We like the shapes, we can paint them all right here. That's right. We like the shapes, we like the shapes, we can paint them all right here. This one is a triangle, it has three sides. This one is a triangle, it has three sides. We make a triangle like this. Like this. We make a triangle like this. Like this. Oh, we like the shapes, we like the shapes, we can paint them all right we can make them all right here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <I'm sorry. laughs> wow, these paintings are terrific. <laughs> Your house came out great, Stephen. Thanks, Keisha. Once I knew how to put a triangle on top of a square, painting a house was easy. Oh, and that yellow circle made a beautiful sun. Oh, you both did a wonderful job. Thanks, Barney. You're welcome. Here, BJ, this is for you, just like we promised. Oh, this is great. Thanks, guys. <laughs> You're welcome, BJ. Hey, there's another circle. You know, circles don't make me feel bad anymore. In fact, I kind of like them. Oh, I'm glad you like circles again, BJ. And I'm really happy that you're feeling better, too. Uh, <laughs> thanks, everybody. <laughs> you really helped me feel a lot better today. Good. You guys are the best. <laughs> oh, boy. You can count on me. I'll always be around. I will cheer you up. <laughs> When you're feeling down I, I like you You like me We have fun together We do When it's sunny When it rains In any kind of In any kind of In any kind of weather Who's your buddy? Who's your bell? <laughs> you can count on Cheer you up when you're feeling.
only one more thing I really want to do today. Mm -hmm. What's that, BJ? Go home and eat a great big round pizza with pickles. I guess you are feeling better. I sure am. Thanks, guys. Oh, shoot. You're welcome, welcome, BJ. BJ. Well, bye, everybody. See you later. <laughs> so Here, BJ. BJ. Don't forget this picture. Oh, yeah. Thanks again. You're welcome. Bye-bye. So bye, BJ. Bye-bye. You've all been such good friends to BJ today. It was fun trying to keep BJ from thinking about pancakes. <laughs> and who knew there were so many circles everywhere? Well, I know I one did. kind of circle that really can make you feel better. What is it? Yeah. Everybody hold hands and you'll see. <laughs> That's it. This is our circle of friends. And it's the best circle of all. <laughs> I love you, you love me, we're a happy family, with a great big hug and a kiss from me to you, won't you say you love me too? fun today. We did have fun today. We always have fun with you, Barney. Oh, yeah. 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 Barney says. <laughs> Hello again to all my friends. I'm glad you came to play. Our fun and learning never end. Here's what we did today. We had lots of fun playing circle games, like Ring Around the Rosie. And what a delicious picnic we had snacking on grapes, cheese, crackers, and carrots. You could say it was a circle picnic. <laughs> BJ certainly ate a lot of pancakes. And he discovered that friends sure can make you feel better if you laugh together. <laughs> or play together. Like having fun playing ball games. Hannah painted a bright sunny picture. And Stephen learned he could use different shapes to make a house. We found lots of circles all around us. And you know what my favorite circle is? Any circle with you and me and all our friends. So take a look around today and see how many circles you can find. I just love having circles of fun. And remember, I love you. <laughs>
drawing for the tree? Yeah. Here's my mom and grandma, my kitten princess, and me. But no brothers or sisters. Did you draw a picture of your family? Yeah, here it is. And look, here's my new baby brother. A new baby? I didn't know your mom was going to have a baby. Well, she's not having the baby. We're adopting him. Wow, you're so lucky. I really wish I had a brother or sister. Yeah, it'll be great to have a little brother. But you know what? What? It's great to have friends, too. Like you. Friends are special, so important they make the world go round. We like helping one another in school or on the playground. Friends are there to help each other. Hi there, it's good to see you. Friends are special, so important, they make the world go round. We like helping one another in school or on the playground. Friends are there to help each other when one is feeling sad. Being friends is very special, be a friend and you'll be glad. It's great to have friends to play with. <laughs> I've got some very exciting news, guys. My family is growing. Growing? Your family is growing? That's right. Kim's family is getting bigger. Oh, well, uh, let's see, Kim. Uh, hmm. Have you and your sister grown taller? Well, maybe a little bit, but that's not what I mean. <laughs> what do you mean? Well, see, in my family, there's my mom and dad, my big sister, me, and now my adopted baby brother. Today is the day he becomes part of our family. <laughs> wow, that really is super deep, super nose. Yeah, little brothers are pretty cool. I have two brothers and two sisters in my family. Ooh, that is a lot of brothers and sisters. You must have lots of fun together. We do. <laughs> How about you, Kristen? Well, there's just me, my mom, and my grandma. I'm the only child in my family. I think being the only child in a family would be neat. Really? Why? Because all the toys are yours. <laughs> I'd rather play with toys with a brother or sister. Well, playing with my sister is fun, but sometimes we can't agree on what we want to play. Well, that can be a problem. Getting brothers and sisters to agree can be sort of hard sometimes. Well, I still think it would be great to have a brother or sister. Each of you may have a different kind of family, but they're all very special in their own way, just like you. <laughs> you are special, you're the only one, you're the only one like you. There isn't another in the whole wide world who can do the things you do. Cause you are special, special. Everyone is special, everyone in his or her own way. Oh, you are special, special. Everyone is special, everyone in his or her own way. <laughs> Because you're here, you should know that we love you. Oh, you are special, special. Everyone is special. Everyone in his or her own way. That's right. So oh, you are special, special. Everyone is special. Everyone in Remember, our little nest was always quite a flutter with my five brothers and sisters. Five brothers and sisters? Mm -hmm. That's a lot. That's really a lot. Oh, yes. 
So, do you have any brothers or sisters, my dear? Nope. No brothers or sisters. Just me. Oh, so you're an only squirrel. Yep. Only me. Well, you're quite enough squirrel for any family, my dear Scooter. Mm -hmm. Quite enough indeed. <laughs> Yesterday, I moved out of my room and into my big sister's room. Why? Because now my room is going to be my little brother's room. Oh, so now you're going to share a room with your sister. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Sharing a room. That sounds great to me. I guess so. So what's the matter? Well, I'm excited about getting a baby brother. But I'm not too excited about sharing a room with my big sister. And she's really not too excited about sharing with me. Well, you know, sometimes it takes a little time to get used to sharing a room. I know just how you feel, Kim. I share a room with my brother. Me too. I share a room with both of my brothers. But you know, sometimes it's fun when we play games. <laughs> but other times your brothers just get into your things without even asking first, right? Right. Well, well, it is a good idea to ask before you play with someone else's toys. You know, I do have my own room, my own things, and my own bed. But I don't have anyone right there to play with either. I think you're so lucky to have your own room, Kristen. Me too, and your own bed. With brothers and sisters, it can get pretty crowded. Well, I can just imagine. <laughs> going to get some sleep tonight. <laughs> oh, I remember. Sometimes our little nest was so crowded, why, you could hardly squeeze a feather between us. Feathers? Mm -hmm. That reminds me, I could use a few good feathers for my bed. Hmm. Where could I get some? Ooh. Ooh. Don't even think about it, my dear boy. I guess I'm pretty lucky to have my own room, but I still think it would be really fun to have lots of brothers and sisters. Wow. Hello, chaps! Hello, Stella! Hi, Barney! What a cool hat and uniform! Why, thank you! See? I've just come from merry old England, where I was visiting the palace guards, and they let me wear this really neat uniform while I helped them guard the palace. I think you look really cool. Why, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> now, did I hear someone say they wish they had lots of brothers and sisters? That was me, Stella. <laughs> well, that reminds me of a story. Would you like to hear it? Oh, sure. Yeah. Yeah. Terrific. But I'm going to need some help from all of you to help me tell it. Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> now, once upon a time, there was an old woman who lived in a shoe. She had so many children, she didn't know what to do. Oh, that is a lot of children. <laughs> she loved them all dearly, each and every one. But with all these children, her work was never done. Now, there was a young girl who lived in a shoe. She had no brothers or sisters. What was she to do? So one day, as she watched all those children at play, she joined in their fun and decided to stay. 
<laughs> there are lots of friends to play with. <laughs> Later, she discovered it wasn't all fun. The little girl wondered just what she had done. See, finding a spot at the table for lunch was not very easy with this hungry bunch. <laughs> Oops, <laughs> it's a little bit crowded. <laughs> Soon it was time for the children to rest. But finding a bed was truly a test. When they were finally tucked into bed, the little girl wished she was at home instead. So before the sun set to bring an end to the day, the girl went back home and decided to stay. Home was so quiet without all the noise. She had plenty to eat and her very own toys. And when it was time for bed that night, she looked out her window and oh, what a sight. The old woman and her children were so happy she could see, but the little girl smiled. My home is just right for me. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> Why, thank you. And I sure had lots of fun sharing it with you. I'm going to tell that story to my new little brother. You're getting a new little brother? Little brothers are wonderful. I think so too, Stella. <laughs> oh my, well, I must be going. I've got to get this uniform back to the palace. <laughs> Cheerio, good friends. Cheerio, <laughs> Toodles. Bye-bye. <laughs> Bye-bye. Hey, I know. Let's make a present for Kim's new baby brother. Oh, that's a great idea, Curtis. Yeah. Thanks. That would be very nice. Well, you know, Curtis, since you and Danny both have little brothers, I'm sure you can come up with a terrific present. That's for sure. If we know anything, we know what little brother's like. Come on, let's go. Okay. And I know that you and Kristen will dream up something very special for a little brother, too. I'm already thinking, Barney. Oh, I can't wait to see what you come up with. So what should we make? Well, uh, oh, well, it's always nice to give someone something that you like. How about a bedtime storybook? Oh. Then I can read to my little brother before he goes to sleep. Well, that'll yeah. be a great gift. And it'll be really special because you both made it. Thanks, Barney. Oh, oh I'll go check on Curtis and Danny. I can't wait to see what they're up to. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, hi there, guys. Hi, Barney. Oh, may I see what you're making? Sure, it's a mobile. Let's see. I need the black marker to draw the soccer ball. Okay. Thanks. Let's see. There. Would you hand me the arm, please? I need to hang the football. All right. Thanks. <laughs> Wow, this mobile is going to look still horrendous. Oh, you two really know how to share together. Thanks, Barney. It's not so tough to share your stuff. It's not so tough to share your stuff. It's not so tough to share your stuff with a friend. Ooh, it's great to learn to wait your turn. It's great to learn to wait your turn. It's great to learn to wait your turn. Be polite. Oh, that's right. When a friend comes over to play, it's not nice to say. That's mine, that's mine, that's mine, mine, mine. Put it back, put it back, put it back, back, back. And when you share, <laughs> you show you care. <laughs> and when you share, <laughs> you show you care. <laughs> and when you share, you show you care for your friend. <laughs> if you want to do what's right, don't hold your stuff too tight. 
It's fun, it's fun, and much more fair. So share, share, share. It's not so tough. It's not so tough. To share your stuff. To share your stuff. It's not so tough. It's not so tough. To share your stuff. To share your stuff. It's not so tough to share your stuff. It's not so tough to share your stuff. It's not so tough to share your stuff with a friend. Looks like you've got everything under control here, so I'm going to see how the girls are doing. Alright, see you in a minute. Okay, see ya. <laughs> Baby brothers, I like the story. Yeah, thanks for helping. You're welcome. So, have you finished the book for Kim's baby brother? We sure did. It's right here. Oh, hey, that looks like a terrific book. Thank you. Thanks, Barney. I'm going to show it to Danny and Curtis. Oh. See you later. Okay, Bye. See you in a minute. Okay. I hope Kim's baby brother will like the book. Oh, I know he will. <laughs> Barney, I think Kim is so lucky to be getting a baby brother. I really wish I had a brother or sister. Well, you know, Kristen, you have your mom and your grandmother. And, of course, you'll always have me. <laughs> You can count on me I'll always be around I will cheer you up When you're feeling down I like you You like me We have fun together When it's sunny When it rains on me I'll always be around I will I will cheer you up when you're feeling down oh. you're, you're my, my buddy I'm your pal side by side we're playing if you ever need my help on your side I'm on your side I'm on your side I'm safe you can count on me Because I am your friend We make a happy team Together to the end You can count on me Because I am your friend That's right We make a happy team Together to the end you can go on me! <laughs> look what Danny and Curtis made. What a neat mobile. I think it'll look great in your baby brother's room. You two did a terrific job. Thanks, Barney. We had fun making it. This is a cool book, too. Your brother will really like this. Yeah, I think you're right. Thanks for these wonderful gifts, everyone, and for being such wonderful friends of mine. <laughs> Let every good friend come and join in a song Singing with friends of mine So here is a song and now pass it along Singing with friends of mine Singing with, singing with, singing with friends Singing with, singing with, singing with friends Singing with friends, singing with friends Singing with friends, singing with friends of mine Get yeah, around everybody a friend on the left and a friend on the right Playing with friends of mine Forever and ever I'm right by your side Playing with friends of mine Playing with, playing with, playing with friends Playing with, playing with, playing with friends Playing with friends, playing with friends Playing with friends, playing with friends of mine <laughs> <laughs> That was fun! I made something else today, Barney. Would you like to see it? Oh, I certainly would! <laughs> what is it? It's my family picture. Oh. Here's my mom and grandma, me, 
And of course, my kitten princess. <laughs> oh, you have a very special family, Kristen. Your mom and your grandmother love you very much. And I know Princess is a perfectly happy kitten. <laughs> You're right, Barney. I do have a wonderful family. Oh, you all do. Moms, dads, grandmas and grandpas, brothers and sisters, too. There's something special about every family. <laughs> oh, a family is people and a family is love. That's a family. They come in all different sizes and different kinds, but mine's just right for me. Yeah, mine's just right for me. <laughs> I've got a friend who lives with his mom and dad, with his brother and sister too. They've got a cat and a dog and a pet bullfrog, and I'm really glad they do. There's a girl I know who lives with her mom, her dad lives far away. Although she sees her parents just one at a time, they both love her every day. Oh, a family is people and a family is love. That's a family. They come in all different sizes and different kinds, but mine's just right for me. Yeah, mine's just right for me. I know a boy who's new, he just moved. Claire, there's nothing better than being with family and friends, my dear. Why, sure there is, Miss Yetta. Sure there is. Well, what's that, Scooter? Why, spending time with family mm -hmm. and friends mm -hmm. and eating lots and lots and lots, of course. <laughs> nuts. Of course. Yeah, you're <laughs> getting it. <laughs> <laughs> Every family is different, but that's what makes them special. <laughs> You're right, Barney. Being with my mom and grandma every day is pretty great. <laughs> and I think having lots of brothers and sisters makes my family really fun. Well, spending time with your family and friends is a very special way to play. <laughs> I love you. You love me. We're a happy family with a great big hug and a kiss from me to you won't you say you love me too home because I want to see my baby brother. Okay. Don't forget to take this or this. Thanks everybody. Bye. So long, see you later. Bye -bye. Hey Kristen, do you want to play with us? Thanks, but I have something else I need to do first. Okay, okay. see you later. Bye. 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 So long. Bye. Want to come with me, Barney? Oh, absolutely. <laughs> picture looks just right to me. Don't you think so, Barney? Bye, Barney. Hey, everybody, it's time for Barney Says. <laughs> Hello 
again to all my friends. I'm glad you came to play. Our fun and learning never end. Here's what we did today. Our families are made of very special people. And our friends are special people, too. Kim's family has a new baby brother. And her friends made some terrific gifts for him. Everyone's family is different. Some families are big. And some families are little. And your family is special whether it's big or little. Because in your family, there's the one and only very special you. I really love spending time with family and friends. And remember, I love you. <laughs>